Primal Blueprint Law number nine, avoid stupid mistakes. You know, people would say, well, maybe that, that's just obvious that you shouldn't do stupid things. I mean, you should wear a seatbelt, you shouldn't smoke, you shouldn't drink too much, um, you know, unprotected sex, all of these things that we sort of, you know, we've heard a lot about and know about. How is this, why is this even a, a Primal Blueprint Law? Well, look, it's there because it's human behavior. Um, the law was what, one of the laws that allowed our ancestors two million years ago, a million years ago, 50,000 years ago, to survive long enough to pass their genetic material along to the next generation so that you and I could be here today. So uh, what that meant in the old days was, you know, don't go tease a bear, right? Uh, don't go jumping off uh, a tree onto rocks. You break a leg and it's basically a death sentence when you were, um, you know, trying to live off the land 50,000 years ago. Today, uh, we get, you know, we sort of get, um, I think, lulled into a false sense of security in a lot of cases. So the seatbelt thing I just mentioned, the smoking, I think we know enough about that. And yet, I know people who smoke. I still know people who are friends of mine who choose to smoke. It's just, it's, it's stupid and they shouldn't be doing it um, because we know the risk is, is high for lung cancer. Uh, texting while driving, there is the new one. I mean, that did 10 years ago, that or 15 years ago, that wasn't a thing. Now it's the cause of a lot of accidents. I don't ride my bike on the roads anymore. That's my avoiding stupid mistakes. Not because I don't trust my own bike handling skills, but because I don't trust people texting and driving who just only need to, to sort of veer over three feet to take, to take me out. Uh, so part of my um, analysis of this law is, you know, what are, what are the things that we do in our lives that are risky that we might choose, if we really thought about them, might choose not to do. Uh, and I recently, I mean, I love snowboarding. Uh, snowboarding was one of my favorite things to do. I'm 65 years old. I can't afford to break my wrist or break my back. Uh, and so I'm less inclined to go down 40 miles an hour down a groomed slope on a snowboard for fear of catching an edge now. I'm just keeping in my mind, I'm avoiding stupid mistakes. And for me, a stupid mistake is something where, you know, after it happens, you go, I knew better than that. I should have thought that through. So that's why it's in there.